What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel and I do appreciate you being here. Today I am back with another Destiny 2 video and today guys I'm going to tell you how you can start the Truth Exotic Rocket Launcher quest which I landed today in Destiny 2. But before we go any further guys, if you do enjoy the video, leaving a like really does help out. And if you are new around here and enjoy daily Destiny 2 videos, be sure to subscribe. Okay, so the Truth Exotic Quest landed today, and if you don't know already, today I'm going to tell you how you can start the Exotic Quest for this weapon. And it's relatively simple, to be honest. All you have to do is load into the Menagerie and defeat this week's boss, who is Onak, beloved by Kalos, some big old dirty looking ogre. Now the method in beating him is relatively easy to be honest, uh, either side of his main room, uh, curse throw, spawn in. You simply destroy these curse throw, they drop orbs, you throw these orbs at Aranok and it's as simple as that. It takes off his shield and you just lay that damage into him. This week it's arc burn, so button them arc weapons people to do more damage, more efficient damage. Same as the subclasses. Now when you get his health down to a certain amount, wizards will spawn in every rotation of these orbs spawning in. So just keep that in mind, they are relatively easy to take out though. But yes, in defeating Aronut Beloved by Kallus, you will start the quest for the exotic rocket launcher, The Truth. You'll get a quest that called a scrap of paper. Now I'm going to do this entire quest, record it all and bring you guys the fastest guide in getting this weapon. So stay tuned for that people. But yeah, this is how you start the exotic quest for The Truth. Get into that menagerie, defeat the boss, Arunak, and you should get it dropped. On that note guys, we have come to the end of the video. Just a short but sweet one informing you guys how to start this quest. On that note, I am out. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks as always for stopping by and hopefully I will see you on that next one.